Are we happy? Oh yeah. He already got his hat on too. Look at him. Oh yeah, got arrested. Possibly some future deer hunting together. Definitely. Troy, good friend of Logan in the rental department. He built a beauty, let's get after it. Full-time review, let's go. 2021 F-150 Lariat 14th Gen lead foot. This color, you know it's popping on anything we do. It just seems to work. No matter if we do small wheel, big wheel, red toe hook, custom paint, no custom paint, the lead foot just is a phenomenal color combo. No matter how you tweak it, but you gotta tweak it, y'all, nonetheless. So my man Troy, uh, great dude, gonna meet him here shortly. We were able to finish his vehicle before the holiday. So that's what, really why we're here today on a Saturday, making sure we get our customers, their vehicles in time to party and celebrate in style. Uh, covert edition let's go so a lariat so i love this package obviously lariat brings a lot of great amenities to it and this pesky front grill we had to do some customizations and actually troy had a lot of input on what he saw uh, and wanted to do on this one so much props to you my man the top and bottom bar we did lead foot to match which is just a game changer and then i love when the lariat doing that middle bar something slightly different so we actually did a satin black matte black finish on that middle bar across there just to notate and to make it stand out that much more different so you can tell a good front appearance how uh, if everything was lead foot it still would have been fine better than factory obviously but the middle bar being black is a subtle thing that just makes it pop gives that off-road inspired theme speaking of off-road we got these tow hooks up front that we did uh, race red that really is the biggest thing that makes it different y'all i mean we've done this uh, grill combo before but doing the tow hooks red and of course his wheel and tire choice is just it, it screams off-roadness it screams ruggedness and that's what i like about uh how we were able to twist this one uh to troy's liking i know he's gonna love it and then obviously up front too y'all we did the blue lead foot and then the chrome that satin matte black finish as well and a good look at your tow hooks uh, and basically to get to the tow hooks, you do have to take the front bumper apart, to, uh, bump pads up front to, to access that. So it's not as easy as, it, as you would seem. It's about a, you know, a two and a half hour process to uh, take apart, put back together, and then the paint is just a whole nother endeavor. Um, so just keep in mind, y'all, you do paint work with us, it's a process. And to do it right, it takes a process, y'all. So keep that in mind uh, with us right here at Aikens. Now we are leveled on 285, 75, 17. He got the Ridge Grapper, which is a great ride quality. We got two inch level kit up front. And uh, the method, you know, the uh, NV305, just a true iconic go-to wheel. I mean, it's been around for so long and it still works so great. Um, in 17 inches, we got a zero offset. So our mild to wild scale is, I guess, in that mid range for our Covert because it does stick out two and a half inches or so which just gives it a great overall appearance and stance. I like the way it turned out uh, from just being a more rugged, bold vehicle. If it was pushed in like a plus 20 on this setup, I think it would have not looked as inspired or, or rugged. So a great offset combination with this one. I love this side shot right here. So you may think it looks a little lower in the front. We are uh, slightly downhill as far as our, our parking lot right here. But it's a true two, two inch ready lift level kit up front. And uh, we did remove his FX4 stickers out back, as well as do a naked spray and liner, guaranteed for life. And then that custom emblem out back, uh, which looks so great. If you don't do the emblem combo, front or rear, then you really don't have a true custom from us right here on our covert, especially with the sport package. Uh, you just gotta do something to it to make it flow. And here on our side badge, we did the same theme of that satin matte black on our teardrop, left that alone because it actually nicely accents your turn signal on the side and then your uh, headlights there also. Now, let me know again what you think. It works on this one, but some of our coverts on these Lariat Sports kind of uh, gets ruined in my opinion because of the, the red that's on all the Lariat Sports now. Because if you got a like a street version covert Lariat Sport, it may not particularly go with what you're trying to do vibe wise, but this color, it has like an earthy vibe to it. It works, y'all. This one works very well because of how 
uh, Troy wanted to build his truck. So it just looks uh, a great combination inside and out. One of my favorite lead foot coverts right here at Aikens. And I know he's gonna love this one. Let me know what you think. And I hope this helps you guys in uh, what you wanna do for your next vehicle, hopefully with us at Aikens. And uh, definitely removing that FX4 sticker on the back. Just really uh, help with the overall appearance. There, too much red in that FX4 sticker uh, would have just kind of ruined that one. So you got a true off-road wheel with a hybrid tire that's gonna be great. Uh, ride quality characteristics, but still also capable off-road. And uh, I love it, y'all. Uh, definitely worth uh, coming in today to make sure we put this thing back together. And I know he's going to shake some waves up uh, over the 4th of July weekend and on his trip next week. So I'm looking forward to hearing back from Troy on uh, how many looks and how many compliments he got on this beautiful covert right here at Aikens and Wild Willies and Winder. So let's all celebrate this weekend, our freedom, and keep our focus and attention on all things positive. And I keep my focus on my creator above because everything's just great, y'all. I'm just down here uh, blessed by the man above building beautiful trucks right here at Wild Willies and Aikens, loving what I do. And we hope it shows in every business transaction we do, in every video that we make. We hope you see that we are uh, proud and confident and humble in being a phenomenal dealership and accessory store. Truly blessed, y'all. Peace.